Hi, air sign. Woohoo! <clears throat> wow. <laughs> wow! Did you feel the energies of that uh, Cancer new moon and eclipse? I sure did, man. Barely got any sleep last night. Wow. So, here we are, air sign. Sun, moon, rising, and Venus. What's going on for you guys? What's happening with your twin flame soulmate relationships? We're looking at the energies, the strongest energies. So, let's see what goes on. I know. I know. It's big. Things. To... July, I wish everyone get what they're aligning themselves with, what they want. What do you want? Do you know? That's a good question to ponder for the weekend. All right, my lovelies. Air signs. The moon. Yeah, something is hidden here. Very, very watery, very uh, Piscean, uh, Cancer Scorpio, water energy here. Very um, muted. Hidden secrets, feelings hidden. Tough, yeah. Tough. Yes, yes, yes. That looks like a bit of stuckness to me. It sure does. Show sure enough does. So, um, air sign. You're a little bit confused here. Seven of Cups, Two of Swords at a crossroads, and then uh, manifesting what it is you want. This is what I just said to you. Wow, that's amazing. <clears throat> what I just said to you is like you're sitting there in this Two of Swords position trying to decide what you want. You, being, you can have anything you want. Anything. What is it? What is it? What do you want? You're, the person you're connected with here, nine of wands, seven of wands, they're really, they've had a, they're in a bad place, okay? Nine of wands, seven of wands, they're resisting talking to you, they're in such a bad place, seven of pentacles, you know, they sort of, look, they planted the seeds for this, they know they need to take responsibility for what's going on in their life right now, but they're not talking to you. No talking. Seven of Wands, High Priestess here. Not talking, not sharing what's going on with them. And this Nine of Wands feeling really beat up. <clears throat> feeling really beat up right now. So the good news is High Priestess Justice is here. Nine of Pentacles. Confidence does return. Okay? The, the justice angel here, that's Libra energy for you guys. <clears throat> Excuse me. Um, this feels just really unclear. And high priestess, you got to go into your own intuition. You got to trust yourself and your high, you ask your higher guides or your higher power, higher self. Justice nine of coins. Knight of Cups, Three of Pentacles, Death. So, <clears throat> fool underneath here. What is wrong? <coughs> um, Knight, of, Knight of Cups. If somebody's offering you a third party situation, Death. You got to decide what you want. This this is very reminiscent of the Empress Club uh, reading I did this morning with a different, completely different deck of um, <clears throat> choosing yourself first. What is it that you really want? Do you really want a third party situation? Do you want that? This person is not really offering you anything right now. They will be offering you something. Knight of Cups, Three of Pentacles, Death, Transformation. 
We're transforming. For some of you, the offer of the third the third party is not what you want. You got to stick with what you want. Okay. Um, I know you want this person. They're in a bad place right now. Nine of Wands. They really have been through it. They're unavailable to you because they've been through it. You know. Yeah, six of coins. The feelings are reciprocal, though. If you if you love them, they love you. I'm not seeing any cups here, any cards about that. Okay, this is not about. This is not necessarily about like, does he love me? Does she love me? Because the feelings are here. Deep, deep feelings are here. It's not really about that. It's like, what do I want for this relationship? You got to know. You got to really go inside. You got to really go inside and tell the universe what you want. Because if they're under the impression that you want a third party, I don't think they want it either. But there's love here. And this person is resisting you. And they are being patient here. They're asking you to be patient. You're kind of blocking your heart from them right now because of what you want. What you want here, three of wands. What do you truly want? I think that's the decision to make here for you. What do you truly want? King of Cups, damn right I do. I want the love. I want to be in, in I want you to tell me your feelings. I want you to be in, have conversation with me. I want you to tell me what is happening. I want you to be open, open your heart to me. Not doing a very good job of that right now. For some of you, they will open their heart. They will tell you how they feel. And this builds foundation. This death card is tricky, though. It feels to me like this, whatever is happening now is going to completely go away. Okay? So for some of you, this relationship is going away. For some of you, it's transforming <clears throat> into something else. You gotta align yourself with what that is. What do you want? What do you want? Because the feelings are here, the reciprocal nature of this is here. Also, this feels to me like they might not be giving very much to you right now. They're not getting very much where they are. They're like empty, they don't have anything to give just yet. Okay? This is really a time when you need to go into your own intuition and understand what it is. Get really clear. Get really clear on what you want. Because we're transforming into something. You are in the driver's seat here in terms of what you want. You can't control this other person. Okay? So don't even try. That's not the exercise here. The exercise here, what the tarot is saying to you, is choose, choose love, choose what it is that you truly want. What does it look like? What does it feel like? Really go into that. What does it look like? What does it feel like? These feelings here, they're so deep down. There's, this, is, this relationship is really bringing up a lot of feelings, a lot of um, uh, unpleasant experiences in terms of like your childhood memories or you know what you see as love being in an unavailable relationship is not love how do you get out of that really aligning yourself with available soulmate relationship available to me aligning yourself with that justice will happen nine of pentacles here being confident um, being stand on your own, knowing what you want, um, and saying it. Really decide. This is the time is now. Time is now. All right, my lovelies. <laughs> so serious. Um, so let's 
if you are so inclined, we're going to do a deeper dive. So click on the link below. This is uh, July, July 14th for air sign. We're going to look at uh, how this is going to play out and get some guidance for you about what you can and can't do here. Okay. All right. So click on the link below. I will uh, see you on the other side.